Perry and John Singleton both passed away due to a stroke just this month. It's an eye opener for many people and a reminder that someone in the United States has a stroke every 40 seconds. Yeah, that's according to the American Heart Association and 13 News Now reporter Megan Shin takes us to the experts at Chesapeake Regional Hospital to remind everyone the signs of a stroke even in younger people. Mm -hmm. Every month, the emergency room staff at Chesapeake Regional Medical Center treats more than 100 people who've had strokes. The hospital is a primary certified stroke center. Alec Collins is one of those staff members. He says there are two ways things that lead to a stroke, a ruptured blood vessel, or a clot that blocks a blood flow to the brain. To identify symptoms, Collins and others use the acronym BFAST. It stands for balance, eye, face, arm, speech, and time. Facial group, weakness, one side of the body, slurred speech. Call 911, treat it like a stroke and you're t until you're told it's not. Collins says if you get to the hospital within three hours after the stroke symptoms start, staff members have a chance at saving your life. We could potentially give you a drug that can break that clot up. A lot of times people brush off the symptoms. Are the signs different when no, someone's younger? No, they're absolutely not. The only reason that makes them different is I'm not expecting to see that in a 51 year old. John Singleton and Luke Perry both were in their early 50s when they died from a stroke. Collins says the major causes of a stroke are high blood pressure, smoking, diabetes, heart arrhythmias, being overweight, and having high cholesterol. All of these things can be controlled except for age and family history. That's why regular checkups and living a healthy lifestyle can be so important. May is National Stroke Awareness Month, a good time to remember to be fast with the signs of a stroke regardless of age. In Chesapeake, Megan Shin, 13 News Now.